Hello everyone, my physique here. Push up is a very popular exercise and for good reasons. Besides its muscle building benefits, a recent study based on firefighters found that people who can do 40 plus push ups have 96% lower rate of cardiovascular events. In this video, we'll go through the only three push up variations that you need to build your chest, shoulder, and arms. If you stay till the very end, I'll show you a very, very common push up mistake. We only need two tools. A, a weighted backpack if you want to make the exercises harder, B, luggage, or anything big that can support your weight. The first variation will help you get that lower chest that you've always wanted. Put the luggage on the ground and elevate your upper body by placing your hands on the luggage. If your luggage isn't stable, then I want you to place your hands on the outer edge. This simple tweak will help you target your lower chest just as decline bench would. Now let me flip it to show you. I want you to fully feel the contraction as you come up, focus your attention on the lower part of the chest and really squeeze it. The second variation will give you a bigger upper chest, anterior delt and lateral delt. This time elevate your lower body by placing your feet on the luggage. This will give a great angle for your upper chest, anterior delt and lateral delt to work, just as incline bench would. Let's flip it. Focus on the contraction and make sure that you descend in a straight line to avoid chest imbalances. The third variation targets the whole chest while shifting more focus to your triceps. It's called diamond push-up and it's essentially a very close grip push-up that targets your triceps. I like making a diamond shape with my hands because it helps me remember how close my hands are and at what angle. This exercise may be hard to do the first time, so give it a few tries. Focus your attention on squeezing the triceps. When doing a push-up, you will want to prevent your elbows from flaring, as that puts unnecessary stress on your shoulder, increasing the chances of injuries. My arms are about 85 degrees out for the demonstration, and that is quite dangerous. I will attach an infographic I made to show you the safer angles. A normal push-up looks like this, where your wrist and elbow are stacked and you're working at a safer angle. Thank you so much for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe, share with your friend if this might help them.